Hey, hey babies and welcome into my channel. In this video, we'll be going over how to change your outlines and switch up your textures inside of Unity. In the program, Vroid does give us an option to add outlines to various parts of our model. However, besides the hair, we can't change the color inside app. Instead, we'll have to go ahead and do that inside of Unity. Right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to export and save our model like we usually would. So you're gonna go to the export as VRM, you're gonna go ahead and make changes based on what you're going to be doing with your model and then save out like you usually would. And then we're gonna open and set up a project in Unity. So the version of Unity I'm using is 2020.3.13F1. And I will be tagging which Uni VRM I am using in the comments below. But for right now, the only package you will need is the Uni VRM to go ahead and import your model. Once you have it, once you have your package set up, you should see the VRM zero over here. We're gonna click that and import our model. Once we have our model in our viewport, she's ready to go. We're going to go ahead and look over to our left hand side and click the folder that says materials. Once that pulls up, you'll see that you have a couple of materials that have like different textures in them. And what you're going to do is you're going to select whatever section you're trying to edit. So for right now, I'm going to change the, the out, I want to change the outline for my hair. So I'm going to click the material that has my hair texture on it. Once you click it, you'll see on your right hand side, the inspector will show up and it'll have some options in it. What we're going to do is go down here to where it says outline and you'll see that you can go ahead and change its width here by clicking and dragging along the slider you can change how thick your outline is and then we can go ahead and change the color by scrolling down and picking a different color here so I'm gonna go with a nice light purple Let's go ahead and change the outline for our outfit while we're here. So I'm gonna go ahead and find the texture that has my outfit in it. And then we're just going to do the same thing. I can adjust my width for how thick that outline is. And then we can go ahead and adjust the color. And voila, that easy. What I also wanted to show you was how you can go ahead and change your textures inside of Unity, switch them out based on whatever it is that you're doing. Um, what we're going to do, we're going to go to our left hand side and click on the folder that says textures and you'll see all of your textures that are attached to your model here. We're going to find the one for Kimiko's hair, which is this one, which is this one. And I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to go to show in Explorer. This is going to bring up its location in the prefab folders that we made for our model. And this folder has all of our textures in it and it highlighted the one that we need. So if we look at the name, it's underscore 16. What we're going to do is we're going to find the texture that I want to switch out with inside of our file explorer and we're going to change the name and import it in here. So what we're going to do first is go ahead and find the texture that we want to switch to. I recommend doing this in a new window so you can keep the window separate. So we're going to do that in by pressing tab and we're going to go ahead and find our file. I'm going to go ahead and copy the texture that I want it, well, I want to switch to. So I'm going to pick this pa hot pastel pink and I'm going to right click it. I'm going to copy and I'm going to paste it inside the same folder. And the one that says copy, I'm going to change the name so that it matches the file that I currently have for the hair. It was underscore 16. So I'm going to change it. I'm then going to copy it with a new name and we're going to go back to our texture folder that has our hair texture in it and we're going to right click and press paste. It's going to ask us if we want to replace the file and we're going to say yes because it's just going to switch it out for us. Once we click back, once that's done and we click back in, you'll see that our hair texture has been changed. And that's pretty much it for this video. Okay, babies, so hopefully that was helpful and you're able to go in there and experiment with different outlines and your textures. If you liked this video, you found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing so that you'll have notifications whenever we upload a new video. Remember that you are loved, you are valued, and you are worth it. And until next time, babies, bye!